on the ground in Haiti, an urgent rescue mission. Thousands of survivors injured in this weekend's devastating earthquake, desperate for medical attention. They're significantly overrun and under-resourced right now. The U.S. Coast Guard landing in hard-hit Lake High just minutes after Tropical Storm Grace drenched the region, racing to help a young child with a broken leg and a nervous mother with few options left. This is what survival looks like in Haiti. The Coast Guard just loaded up seven patients, some of them very young. They're airlifted to the capital, Port-au-Prince, after waiting days for help. We hope we can get just as many as possible. Some of these kids that we've seen, they've had buildings come down on their parents and they're all alone. And it really is just so heartbreaking. The Haitian government says the death toll here has soared to nearly 2,000 people. Almost 10,000 have been injured. UNICEF estimates the quake damaged or destroyed 84,000 homes. One of the toughest parts about this relief operation is getting supplies to the people that most need it. Many roads are shut down, cutting off entire communities. For a country that's already seen so much tragedy, hope is in short supply, which is why when retired flight paramedic Teresa Gray heard about the quake, she flew in from Alaska, one of many American volunteers now rushing in to help. It's always an urgent need when Haiti is in trouble, always. That's why we've been here a number of times, because when Haiti gets in trouble, they get in trouble badly, and we need to be here as soon as possible to help as much as we can. Again, after dropping off those patients just moments ago, the Coast Guard is once again preparing to head back into the air to some of these hard-hit regions. Now, the United Nations has set aside $8 million in relief, but damages here in Haiti are expected to cost billions. Hoda? All right, Gabe Coudiers for us there in Port-au-Prince. Gabe, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.